Hello. Who are you? Quack, quack, quack. What does the duck say? Quack, quack, quack. Can you say quack, quack, quack too? Quack, quack, quack. And how can we help you, duck? Oh, here's Wally. No, you definitely don't say quack, 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 do you, Wally? No, you don't. But what's this duck want? She wants us to help find her little ducks. How many little ducks have you got? Five little ducks. I know a song all about five little ducks. Maybe if we sing it, we can help you find your five little ducks. What do you think? Yes. And let's say quack, 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 just like Mama Duck. Quack, quack, quack. <laughs> wow, look what we have here. We have five little ducks. Will you count them with me? You hold up one hand and we'll count your fingers while I count the ducks. One, two, three, four, five. Now let's make the five little ducks dance. They're going to go on an adventure and we're going to help Mama Duck find them. Five little ducks went out one day over the hill and far away. Mother Duck said quack, 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 quack. But only four little ducks came back. One, two, three, four. Ducks went out one day over the hill and far away. Mama Duck said quack, 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 quack. But only three little ducks came back. One, two, three. Three little ducks went out one day over the hill and far away. Mama Duck said quack, 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 quack. But only two little ducks came back. One, two. Two little ducks went out one day over the hill and far away. Mama Duck said quack, 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 quack. But only one little duck came back. One! One little duck went out one day over the hill and far away. Mama Duck said quack, 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 quack. But none, none of the five little ducks came back. Oh no, she's sad. The duck went out one day over the hill and far away. Mama Duck said quack, 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 quack. But all of the five little ducks came back. Five little ducks went out one day over the hill and far away. Mama Duck said quack, 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 quack. And all of the five little ducks came back. Hooray! We helped you find them, didn't we? Will we count them for you? We have one, two, three, four, five little ducks. Fantastic! Can you help me turn the book the right way today? Is it like this that I hold my book? No. Is it like this that I hold my book? No, it's upside down. Maybe if I turn it like this. Yes, that's how I open my book. Now let's see what book we have today. It's called A Splendid Friend Indeed. And it's by Suzanne Bloom, published by Alana Books. And let's see what we can see on the cover. There is a bear and I think this is a duck. The duck is getting a big hug from the bear. Let's see what happens. There's lots of beautiful pictures in this book. And we love looking at the pictures. There aren't, aren't too many words in it, but that means we can enjoy looking at the pictures. The duck is running along, looks very excited. And we see where he's actually running is down the bear's back, onto the bear's head, and he's looking into the bear's eyes and he's saying, what are you doing? Are you reading? He sees him with a book, so obviously he's reading. What does Bear say? Bear says nothing. 
But Duck continues to talk. I like to read, says the duck. Oh, the bear doesn't look too happy. He looks a bit annoyed, doesn't he? Do you want to hear me read, says the duck. I don't think Bear looks like he wants to listen to the duck reading. Now what you doing, asks the duck. Are you writing? Yes, the bear is writing. He looks like he's quietly writing and doesn't want to be disturbed. I like to write, says the duck. <laughs> Do you want to see me write? Asks the duck. Does it look like Bear wants to see him writing? No, it doesn't. He looks like he wants to be left alone. What you doing now? Asks the duck. Thinking. And the bear's nice and quiet there, thinking his own thoughts. And the duck wants to know, what you thinking? Thinking makes me hungry. Are you hungry? Asks the duck. I think I'll make a snack. And he runs off. <gasps> the bear looks a little bit angry. He's folded his arms and his eyes look a little bit angry, don't they? Looks like he's a bit annoyed at the duck. So the duck comes back not just with a snack, but with a blanket and a bag full of snacks. I'm back. I made a snack, says Duck. And Bear looks like he wants to quietly write by himself. I wrote a note. I'll read it to you, says Duck. Oh, he looks so happy, but look at Bear. Bear is putting his hands and his book over his head like he wants Duck to go away. I like you. That's what the duck's note says. Indeed I do. You are my splendid friend. He looks so happy. He must have written this for Bear. Bear looks surprised. His eyes are open wide and he's sitting up straight. Thank you, says Bear. I like you too. Indeed, I do. Is he wiping a little tear from his eye? Because he's so touched by the lovely duck's words. He's telling him he's his friend too. Oh, look, a big cuddle. You are my splendid friend, my splendid friend indeed. And this is where Bear gives duck a really big hug. And they're both smiling and they love their cuddles. And now it's time for them to have a snack. And a little drink, I think, too. And when we're finished with our book, we close it and we can read it all over again. All about the bear and the duck who really are good friends. We had so much fun today. We helped find five little ducks for Mama Duck. We got to say quack, 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 just like a duck. And we heard all about the bear and the duck that were splendid friends indeed and loved to cuddle each other. Let's see who I can see in my bubbles today. I can see Angie and Zoe. Hi girls. I can see Killian watching me too. And I can see two really good friends. They're called Ailish and Ileana. And right now they love looking at me in their two different houses. But really soon they'll be able to watch me when they're together and they can give each other a big hug. Hi girls, keep singing and dancing. And now it's time for me to say, Slán gach See you next time.